My name is Leonard Martin Hewitt. I live in San Francisco, California, and I am a fine art photographer. If you are an artist, you can create something out of almost anything. If a camera is your tool, anything you find around you can become art. Different patterns, different textures, different colors. You can find something beautiful and unusual to shoot wherever you are. And I find it most helpful to not have a preconceived idea of what it is you're gonna shoot. For example, I recently had a show where the gallery owner had pre-selected one of the images that she really wanted to see in the show. And it was a picture that I took in Portland uh, at Cathedral Park of the St. John's Bridge. And it's a really pretty picture. So I thought, okay, well, I can't just have one picture of a bridge. Why not try to get an iconic photograph of the Golden Gate Bridge from San Francisco, you know, my other home. Fort Point is an historic military site located underneath the Golden Gate Bridge. And I found that Fort Point itself was speaking to me in a way that I hadn't anticipated at all. It has beautiful lines, it's got really beautiful light and shadow, and I ended up getting a lot of images that I really, really liked because I wasn't looking for them. I kind of let the environment speak to me and I captured some really interesting shots in stairwells. And once I started seeing those images, I kind of warmed up to the idea of just kind of looking at the bridge with new eyes. What I end up doing is going home, plugging it into my computer and realizing I took 500 pictures. <laughs> Uh, and obviously not all of them are going to work, but hopefully 10 will work. In post-production, the next step would be to go in and really bring out what you want in the picture. There are so many things that you can do with it. The best part about printing is going to the photo lab and picking up the print. Hi Chris, how are you? I'm well, nice to see you. It is physical and it is tangible and you see how delicate the print is. It's very different from seeing something on screen. There's really no end to the options at the photo lab. You can print on canvas, you can print on glossy paper, semi-glossy paper, metallic paper, pearlescent paper, and then you get to pick all of the different finishes. Glossy finish, semi-gloss finish, opaque finish. So it's just a whole nother step to the creative process that a lot of people don't realize. Mounting and framing is the final part of the whole process. And there is a whole world of mounting and framing options, whether you mat, whether you do a panel, whether you do gator board. And definitely I encourage people to try new things and you know, not be afraid to make mistakes because that is how you learn what works and what doesn't work. It was so lovely of Cindy Hawkins to ask me if I would be interested in being a featured artist at her gallery. Once you get there, you know, there's a whole nother can of worms for you. And I knew that there was gonna be some math involved, but I was very reluctant because I'm an artist, not a mathematician. I wanted to not only show new work, but I wanted to show it in a different way. I really wanted it to be more of a collage, which ended up working really well for the space and for the pieces. Oh, look, it's done. We had a wonderful opening night. Her partner, Coop, and Cindy were both there, and it was a wonderful reception. Yeah. Oh. And if you look at it up close, like over here. When I'm not San Francisco, I'm here. LeonardMartinHewitt.com is a great place to look at some of my past collections to keep up with what I'm working on with what's coming up in the near future. It's a great place to contact me as well if you have questions, if you wanna buy something. If you wanna buy something, you can reach out to me via the website. And you can see uh, the work that I'm the most proud of there. LeonardMartinHewitt.com. <laughs>